Hey guys, this is Tybon Skyberg here. Today we take a look at as the another toy review. Today we take a look at as the Hot Wheels with Batman Returns, the Penguins Duck Vehicle. All right, so uh, I don't know what to say about this vehicle right here. So I used to have as this this vehicle right here, which was after I got the the Batmobile, the Michael Keaton one, and it's the same thing from Batman Returns, and of course the Batman '89, and of course I used to have a, this this vehicle right here back in the '90s. But uh, unfortunately, what happens now? It's some kind of breaking the wheels. Uh, the, that's not a usual like that anymore. And of course, the paint job was broken. Uh, that I used to have a way back in the 90s. And of course, well, I got, I picked this up at this one right here. It cost me like $8 when I was at a, what was on uh, Bonson Novels or Walmart. I don't know, whatever that's left that they got. All right, so I, I got this and revised it, and I, I really like this vehicle. I used to have those back in the 90s. So, all right, let's take a look at the package of himself. And, of course, it says Hot Wheels, Batman Returns, and it says the Penguin, the Duck Vehicle. You guessed it. And, of course, the inside, and, of course, on the top and the bottom, it says HotWheels.com information. It says Mattel, okay, from made Mattel. And left and right, not much. And, of course... And at the rest of them, you get Corlette, the the one that says uh, the the different versions of Hot Wheels. And I used to have uh, the Batman '89, and of course Ben Affleck's Batmobile. But the rest of them I don't have. And of course the animated series of the 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 same year, what was that? Before or after Batman Returns? I'm not sure. And of course the Penguin him vehicle himself, the duck vehicle, but that paint job looks familiar, just like I used to have this, this colored paint details right here. So, but they're gonna go, this redesign for a repaint job or something like that in front of the actual movie, so. All right, let's get this open and let's see how this goes, guys. All right, here is the Penguin's duck out of the packaging. Well. It's not much really here, so uh, here it is. So what do you guys think about this vehicle right here? Now, if you've seen a little closely the, the one that the image looks like, uh, if you so far I can tell that that paint job looks like that the originally looks like, and of course they got to go redesign what it looks like, the, the color yellow difference. But the originally it's supposed to be, I forgot what line is that when I used to have, but that color yellow that I used to have, the, the paint job. But this one here is yellow, more yellow, orange a little bit. So that, that the vehicle was changed. And I like the certain more, like, just like at the actual movie. So in case, if you've seen what the wheels looks like, from, unfortunately, my iPod, it's still really pain. So because as I can't even see what it looks like. All right, so you can see the paint job looks like. Yep, it does, it looks like. So... All right, let's take a look at the, the Penguin vehicle duck himself. It looks very, exactly very good. I want to talk about a little bit turns like that. So now you can see it looks exactly at the actual movie. So in course, and of course you got it, you can see it on, on the left here. And of course, and you can't see it on the front because it's to not moving or so something like that. So you can go more like these ones. Uh, unfortunately, because this wheels are really pain. Uh, so you can see uh, um, uh, because of my, my iPod. So, but so far I can tell that it's the the wheels, just like at the actual movie. And of course, you got right here. It's on like there at the same time. So now the behind them, same thing. And of course, but if you want to turn like this, so like this. And of course, and then you got the the cockpit itself and the when penguin got this inside of the vehicle if you seen did, did you seen that this movie this is a scene where when the penguin uh captured uh he wants to uh the scene that the actor was his name christopher walken mesh shrek mesh shrek <laughs> The, the the character this name yeah when he caps it at this guy that he was the one responsible I don't know for betrayal Batman thing I don't know this is seam work so anyway so it goes like this and there's not much it has to say about this I do like the fact this this vehicle it looks very uh, amazing and and that's it that's the penguin stuck vehicle for you guys 
All right, so here's my two comparisons with two Batmobiles, one for the Batman in 89 from the Michael Keaton, and of course, you got Ben Affleck's Batmobile from Batman v Superman. Yeah, here's my the comparison. There are, I think, is this one in the middle as tall as is this one. So uh, if you've seen in my 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 toy review the two Batmobiles with Michael Keenan and a Ben Affleck's vehicles, go check them out. It's on on my channel. So uh, here's the one, and I like this. Is it the eighty nine? I prefer to this one. Ben Affleck on on a, on a hand. I do like this one too. So now. Here's one of the both comparisons, and this one is a little bit tall as this one with these ones, guys. So, anyway, so that's it. Uh, that's my comparison with the vehicles for you guys. So, my final thoughts with the Penguin Stuck Vehicle from the Batman Returns. I gotta say, it looks... This vehicle, it looks really, really good. I like the deal of the fact this with the, with the the wheels. Uh, it's the same one like uh, this one, and uh, yeah, I like to everything. The paint job looks very good, and of course, Mattel Mattel has owns a Hot Wheels, so now this, it looks very good. I like the the fact this and make it a little bit more just like a the actually from the movie. And of course, yeah, I like everything is on there. What else? So. Uh, my final ratings for the dark vehicle, the penguin from Batman Returns, I'm going to give it this one like a 10 on a 10. Mattel, I love it. I love it. This effect is, I like this vehicle right here. That reminds me in the back in the 90s, and now I revise it. It's, it looks very good. All right, so that's come out a 10 on a 10. So... Anyway, don't forget, click like, comments below, don't forget subscribe, and of course, don't forget, check that the icon bell, no notifications in case you missed it or not. So, anyway, this is Tybone Skyberg, and I'll see you around, guys, and happy toy hunting, and take care.